All right, we're gonna do another quick video. So it's gonna be, I gave the pizza guy the, and we have our blends with G. And that is a good way to do, to do K, the K, K with R blends and the G, G with R blends because K and G are in the back of our throat. So encourages the back of your tongue to pull back for our R. So if we're gonna do a blend, this is a great one to start with. So we have grass, green, grill, grandma. Oh, she's so cute. Grain and groundhog. So we want to make sure we're not saying glass or glass. I don't want to hear any W's in here. So if you can, watch yourself as you're saying these. So you can see if your mouth's open really wide or if your lips are coming together wah, wah, like a W. All right, we're going to put this guy over here. I gave the pizza guy the grass. This sentence is gonna be silly. I gave the pizza guy the green, not green, not green, green. Focus on keeping your tongue all the way in the back at the beginning. I gave the pizza guy the grill. I gave the pizza guy the grandma. That's a silly sentence. I gave the pizza guy the grain. I gave the pizza guy the groundhog. Now, another thing you can do is if you want to separate the G from the R sound, the G and the R sound, to work on these words, you can say grass before you say grass. You can say reen before you say green and then blend them together. So you can say reen, g green green kind of separate them and then bring them together G green 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 G grill let me show you what i do G grill 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 see how i'm doing that just some tips different things you can do and all i want the pizza guy to give me is pizza but you're giving him all the things nice job